In today's Your Healthy Family, April is Oral Cancer Awareness Month. Close to 54,000 Americans will be diagnosed with oral or oropharyngeal cancer this year, causing over 9,000 deaths. Most of the time we know that the dentists are in an ideal position. We're dental hygienists. We will ask patients, do they have anything that they consider abnormal in the mouth? What we know is that oral cancer, if caught in an early stage, is very treatable. The problem is the majority of them are not caught in an early stage because they're not screened as when they're a very small lesion. That lack of screening and early detection translates to about one death an hour in the United States because of oral cancer. And just because you live a healthy lifestyle doesn't mean you're safe. We know that in about 30% of the cases that someone develops an oral cancer, they didn't have the typical high risk factors of, let's say, smoking, tobacco use, chewing tobacco, um, vaporizers, uh, they weren't heavy drinkers. A combination of all those three really increases your odds. Screening should happen while you're at your dentist. And Dr. Guerra says oftentimes the first signs of an oral or head and neck cancer won't be in your mouth. Many times the first sign or symptom of a head and neck cancer that we might see is when we're actually in there palpating some of the lymph glands and nodes around the head and neck structure. Oral cancer um, can manifest itself in the mouth as maybe a, a sore a white lesion. Uh, to some patients, it may look like a cut. It may look like a bump. Once we find something that we might consider suspicious or it has given the patient a problem, the only diagnosis of, of a cancer, of course, is a biopsy. We might therefore refer them to an oral surgeon, or if it's a simple biopsy, we could perform it in our office. Again, early detection is key in surviving oral cancer. So make sure you're seeing your dentist at least twice a year and pay close attention to anything out of the ordinary happening in your mouth, no matter how small. For your healthy family, Meyer Cronin. For more stories, head to yourhealthyfamily.com.